Hi there, my name is Christine Hall. I'm the Online Business Manager at Christine Hall & Associates. In today's video tutorial, I'm going to show you how to use SynthShare's Manage Post Library. Once we get to the library, we're going to show you how to view history, pending posts, as well as save posts. We're going to talk about filtering, sorting, as well as viewing, reposting, and deleting posts. So let's go ahead and take a look at that page. On the far left hand side of the since share window you're going to see the teal bar the side menu bar i'm going to ask you to locate the manage library or post library button go ahead and click on that when you do the manage post library um, screen or page will appear the first thing you'll see at the top of the screen is an empty text box that says uh, select networks slash categories to filter. When you click inside this box, it will then provide a drop down list of the various networks that you have access to, as well as any categories you may have assigned. In a few of the previous videos, we, um, we assigned categories to posts as well as showed you how to refresh your network and add favorites as well as how to set defaults on those network places. In today's video, I want to show you um, how to get around and manage within the Manage Post Library. So after that text box at the top, you'll see three headings, history. History will then show you any of the posts that you've already scheduled using your since share um, social media scheduling tool. If you click on pending, what you'll see here are any of the posts that have yet to be posted. So you'll notice there is a date and time at which these posts will go off. Um, as well, if you look at the thumbnail, you will see where it's going. So Facebook or Instagram or Pinterest or Twitter, and then which of the networks it's being posted to. Um, and then you're going to see a third item at the top that is going to allow you to see any posts that you have saved at this point, but not yet scheduled. So I'm going to ask, uh, I'm going to go back and click on the the uh, history. And when I click on the history, I'm just going to select the category category called jewelry. And you'll see we have one post here that has been assigned that category that has been um, submitted or already posted. So to remove that filter, you just click on the X beside the category name, and then all of the posts will come back. If you want to repost one of your previously posted um, posts, what you'll do is you'll click on this repost, or it looks like a little recycle button. When you click on that, it then takes you back to the schedule a post page, and the message that appeared in the original will then appear again in your post message. The image will appear in the post photo section, and then you would, of course, choose the date, the time, assign it a category, and then um, choose which of the networks it's going to go in and hit your schedule post button. So that's how you are going to use the feature called repost. I'm back here at the manage post library window again. And what I want to show you are just a couple of other things. Let's move over to the pending now. So these are posts yet to go off. Let's say for some reason I decided I was going to stop sending a couple of posting, pardon me, a couple of these um, items. I could click on the checkbox in the top right hand corner of the thumbnail and then I'm going to do it with a second one just to show you that you can select multiple. If you want to, you can actually select all as well by going over to the menu on the far right hand side under the search box there are select networks slash categories to filter box when you click on that menu button you'll see there is a feature an option to select all when you select all every one of the items is selected in the pending so i'm going to go ahead and just take a few of these off and show you that i can go back and I can choose to um, clear the selection as a whole in one kind of batch, 
And I can also, if I want to select one now, delete one. And you'll notice there are several other functions that can be performed here in the Manage Post Library. Uh, I'm going to talk about these other ones in it, their own separate video as many steps are involved. Uh, here I'm just showing you or explaining to you the delete function. So if you have a pending post and you no longer want that to go, you can select the post and then go to the menu and delete that. I'm not going to delete it at this point, but that's what you could do. And that is just a little bit about your Manage Post Library in Decent Share um, social media scheduling platform. I hope you've enjoyed these tips. Um, please stay tuned for the next video in which I will show you how to use some more of these features here, the find and replace, the time shift, the batch post, as well as uh, how to create and share a collection. That's everything for now. I hope you're having a great day. Please enter any questions you have in the comment section of this video. And don't forget to follow me online at Christine Hall Online on my Facebook page for additional tips, tricks, and tutorials. Have a great day, everyone.